guys, so here's a, here's my interpretation of how to play Run. And um, I don't want to go like too crazy on this video if uh, anybody wants me to do a lesson later on with the guitar solo or something. Um, just leave me some leave me some notes or uh, comment. But I'm just going to go ahead and try to explain this uh, again, just being as beginner friendly as possible. So, um, you know, standard tuning, um, just make sure you're in tune. And then um, if you know an E minor chord, um, that would be your middle finger on second fret of the A and ring finger on second fret of the D. Now you don't need your middle finger down, so really you can just kind of leave your ring finger down on that second fret of D and just make sure that the G and the B string can ring open. So you're going to you know, press your ring finger down there and you're going to play the low E, then the D, then the G, and then the B, and then back to the B, and then back to the D. So you got... So just E, D, G, B, G, D, all right? Now see where your ring finger is on the second fret of the D. You're gonna just hop that down to second fret of the G, all right? So you just went from here to here. Now you're gonna place your index finger on the first fret of the D chord, then your middle finger comes up here to grab second fret of the low E. And you're gonna, again, do the same plucking pattern. It's gonna be E, D, G, B, G, D, E, D, G, B, G, D. So in, in the way I'm plucking that pattern is I'm going down, 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 up, up. And that could be a matter of preference, but I figure when you're going down, you pluck down, and when you start coming back up, you pluck the strings up. So down, 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 up, up. So I just keep it that the same way for the first two chords. All right. So now after that funky chord uh, with your middle finger, second fret of E, index finger, first fret of D, ring finger, uh, second fret of G. Whoops. What you're going to do now is um, take your ring finger and move it up here to third fret of the low E. And uh, you could just continue up with your middle if you want, but I think just moving that ring finger up makes this just a little more beginner friendly. So you're going to uh, pluck, you're going to hold down third fret of the low E now. So you just walked up to that third fret of the low E. You're going to play that note, same, same plucking pattern. So you just got E, D, G, B, G, D. All right. Now you're, you're going to do the little uh, walk down riff. So your ring finger jumps to third fret of A, and you're going to pluck. And then you're going to set your middle finger down, second fret of A, then open A, then ring finger again, third fret of E, and then back to open A. So you've got 3rd fret of A, 2nd fret of A, open A, 3rd fret of E, open A. Okay, so when you get to that A, that signifies that we're going to move to the A minor chord. So your index finger sets on the 1st fret of the B, middle finger, 2nd fret of the D, ring finger, 2nd fret of the G. And now you're going to do the same plucking pattern we were before, except the low note is the A note. So you're going to be like... Okay, so you've got A, D, G, B, e, G, D. So, the, so this time, we, we're, going to, we're going to do the walk riff again. So you're going to go... Say this is the first time doing the walk riff. Right? Okay, then you're going to start the riff again, or you're going to start the uh, plucking pattern again. You're going to go A, D, G. Then you're going to do the walking riff again. Back to A minor again. This time for a full full two times through that plucking pattern. All right. So we've got the walking riff. We'll 
walking riff, and then two full times through that plucking pattern, okay? And then I think it just repeats from here for a while anyway throughout the song. So that's all I'm going to show on this video. Um, leave a comment if you want me to try to do some more on this tune. But that, um, yeah, so right after that, it's going to repeat. So let's go ahead and just try to break this down real slow. So again, starting with ring finger on that um, second fret of D as, as uh, reminiscent of an E minor chord. So you're going to just ring finger, second fret of D, and then we're going to uh, start the plucking pattern. And I'll try to go a little slower here. So we've got... Okay, now remember that next chord, middle finger comes up to second fret of low E, ring finger jumps down to second fret of G, index finger sets down first fret of D. Now, ring finger walks up one more to third fret of the low E. Now we're gonna do the uh, walking riff. Third fret of A, second fret of A, open A, third fret of E, open A to the A minor chord. Then, walking riff again, this time two full plucking patterns, and then back to the first chord again. So one more time, I'll just try to walk this real slow and I won't talk this time. <laughs> so here we go. see the pattern developing there so uh, go ahead hit the like button subscribe and um, go ahead leave me a comment if you want to learn something else about this song and I'll see you on the next video